Hey boys, welcome back to some more Cricket 19 career mode, and as you would have seen quickly at the start there, we're actually the new captain of, uh, of Red Cliff here. We, oh, God, we look like an absolute freaking goose, dude. I, I don't know, should I take the glass? You know, I think, I think the glasses suit us, but, um, yeah, it's, it's good to be the, it's good to be the captain. Um, you know, things are starting to progress. I did... A couple of episodes, probably, uh, a few episodes ago now, I did put the, uh, like the rec what's it called? Um, not recruiting, but like your ability to get selected, selection status, whatever. I put that down to easy, um, you know, cause I, I would like to make first class cricket basically as soon as possible. So I put it down to easy. And then obviously when we, when we eventually make first class, we'll put it back to normal, because I don't want to, you know, I don't want to fast track straight into internationals when I'm, like, very low rated, but, you know, I, I think, um, I think putting it down to easy at the start here, we've been playing well, I mean, uh, our form has definitely increased the last couple of, a couple of games, is that one? A little bit too much bounce, not a, not a bad little shout there, uh, but we are bowling first in this match, I think it's a, um, what is it, a 50 over game, I think, <laughs> I, <laughs> I don't know, but we did put ourselves up the order to number four, which, you know, that, that was sort of the main thing, I could have brought myself up to number three, which wouldn't have been a bad, bad thing to do, uh, but it obviously is a 50 over game, because we're coming back in here with the scores, well, when we, when we change the field, you know, I haven't really talked about too much about the fielding menu and stuff, but it's very, like, it's good, it's, it's pretty much the exact same as last game, but I think it works very well, um, yeah, I think they did a very good job, but we come back in, our fourth over, and they are none, jeez, the noise, <laughs> it got stuck in his pad, the noise it makes, it's so buggy, dude, when it, like, hits their pad and stuff, like, it just sort of rattles around, um, is this one again? He's having a bit of trouble here, but they're, they're going pretty well. 5 for 235. Um, a couple of newish batters to the crease, though, which is a bit of a worry for them. We'd love to just get a couple more to bring the tail into the fray. Uh, continue on here. Fifth over. That one's a short white. What has happened there? He's taken it. The keeper, he's happy. <laughs> he's a wicked. <laughs> Oh, we just slid this one in a little quicker, a little flatter, and it's a tough catch. It's come off his freaking pad. <laughs> what a take by the keeper. You know, that one I, I talked to last couple of episodes, there's been some superhuman type efforts from the keeper teleporting, but right there, that was just um just good heads up play from our from our boy behind the stumps, you know. Gotta be <laughs> <laughs> Got to be happy with the the commitment there. So one for twelve, very good wicket. Is this one? How is that missed? He's trying to play the uh, the pull shot there. It just went over middle stump for God's sakes. Is this one? What a nut <laughs> that is! <laughs> that is sensational. This time a little bit fuller, and it has rattled the top of our stump. Just an absolute. Absolute beauty, absolute beauty, and we got to look at the replay. Unfortunately, it uh, it went straight to the next bowler, so I didn't get a chance to to look. But here we go, just yeah, a bit a bit a bit fuller. Was it the toppy? Might have been the top spinner. It just sort of held its line a little bit and just clipped the bail. That is that's as good as it gets, really. Hitting hitting that that part of off stump can't get much better, so what a, what a bit of bowling, 2 for, uh, 2 for 12, we've really pegged them back, they're now 9 for 245, this has been an excellent, um, bit of bowling for us, they were, they were, they were on track for a, for a 300 score, easy, but now it's looking a little bit, a little bit dicey, well, not a little bit, <laughs> we'd be pretty frustrated if they get to 300 from here, that's for, that's for sure, and hopefully we can, uh, we can get the third wicket, and, is that one a drop catch? I think it might have been a, a tough chance again. A pretty thick edge. Unfortunately, just didn't carry to the slips fielder off the uh, off the keeper. But there we go. There's the third wicket. What a what a spell of bowling. This one again, just tossed up there. I think again it was the top spinner, and it just sort of it just didn't quite. Sp I don't know, it looked like a just a genuine leggy and a nice healthy edge. A great take from the keeper. That's a that's a tough catch, but. He's done an excellent job there. And, you know, 
on the back of our bowling, really. We have pegged them back. I think we came... That, I thought they were only like four or five out for 240. So they've literally made no runs and lost the rest of their wickets. So that's a bit of a... um. A bit of a blunder from uh, from the team batting first here. And look at that beautiful wicket. Just, um, yeah, sensational bowling. We are we are an all-round, as you can see there, 11-2, duck, duck, two. So that's, they had one player get 113 and then the rest of them just absolutely collapsed. Um, so, yeah, got to be happy with that. Now we're going to come into bat with um, confidence sky high to peg them back for... 246 got to be happy with it and uh here we go so here's a here's a menu for like the batting you can obviously promote other players um pretty easily and i, I almost mucked it up there because i was like do i have to select my player or what but now you just you just hit back and your player will come in next so yeah we are out in the crease now and a pretty good platform two for 110 as Sutherland is uh, steaming in. Was this, um, is this the same team? Cairns? We, I feel like we versed Cairns like four matches in a row, dude. <laughs> I, I faced one over of Sutherland with that big hundred. And we hit him for four fours in a row. And then the rest of the bowling was just full on spin. So we haven't faced too much pace. That's a beautiful shot. Now, you know, we're just in fantastic touch with the bat. And now the ball as well, but yeah, we didn't we didn't face much pace in that three day match against Cairns, but we might get a bit more in this one. Is that's a well fielded from uh, from the man at point? That's a that's saving four as he uh, hits us on the back of the on the back there. Not a not a very nice thing to do, but you know that's fine. <laughs> so, uh, we just leave that one alone. Not a not a bad little uh, little lead there, Sutherland. It's a it is a greenish pitch, so. It was there was a little bit of bounce. Got to be got to be a little cautious, cautious, careful of uh, of those good length deliveries on and around off stump, like usual. But you know, with this type of pitch, you want to be probably just get yourself in as I'm uh, gonna push for two. That's a risky two. He does just get back a little bit dicey. He didn't really put the strides in at the end there, which was. <laughs> A little bit nervous. Allen is on 72 off 76, so he's he's batting very nicely. Don't really want to run him out as we face um, some left arm quick coming around the wicket. He gave us a nice, juicy full toss outside the line, but just couldn't get it through that inner ring there. And, uh, you know, they, they've got a fairly, a fairly attacking field or a, a field to stop runs as we try to just blast that one downtown. Just missed it all together we timed it ideal but just missed it <laughs> it was the ball to hit too we would have just just nailed it out of the ground but he's given us some he's given us some balls to hit we just couldn't <laughs> we couldn't hit it as that is beautifully worked just a single we're gonna push for two actually it's gonna be a tight two but uh alan is gonna make the ground nicely so trail's still just under 100 just over 100 here uh, 102 to get so you know it's uh it's looking good we'd like to be there for the winning runs for sure as this one is played nicely off the back foot again gonna push for two easy as you like the field is very sluggish there and uh getting it pretty comfortably so moving on to 16 or 14 we found it a little bit tougher than uh the three-day action at the minute the fields are just a little bit more defensive and <laughs> yeah just struggling a little bit for uh for timing and and placement at the minute but we're hanging in there well not hanging i mean we're going as more than a runner ball so we we can't be too um too disappointed with it alan is uh is the anchor up the other end and we're just playing playing our usual game at the minute that's a beautiful shot this time here was some power not just a flick of the wrist that's um driven well through that wide mid on area and that's going to be four every day of the week so the score Target is now below 100, which is very good. Only two wickets out, so got to be happy with that one. Oh, geez. That one actually cut. Um, it almost hit the freaking stumps. It was pitched way outside leg. We tried to just mow it to the leg side, and it just didn't happen. Oh, man. Again, we tried to come down the track. Another full toss. I don't know how we missed it, dude. I thought it was there for the absolute taking, but... We just missed it, so hopefully the guys can, you know, it was a little bit, a little bit aggressive maybe, but it looks like we did get the job done, so 
no harm there. And uh, I pick up man of the match, surprisingly. Probably Allen deserved it. Um, but we get it. We got a 21 and the three. I mean, our three for 12 definitely changed the game. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. Make sure to like and comment and I'll see you in the next one.